Good morning, great morning. I'm Tiara and I'm here for Verses of the Day with T. Today's verse of the day comes from First Theologians chapter 5, verse 16. Before we get into the reading of God's word, we start off with prayer. So let's pray. Dear Lord, Heavenly Father, we thank you for waking us up this morning and starting us on our way. We thank you for all that you have done and all that you will do. Lord, we trust you. Order our steps. Lead us and guide us to our purpose and our destiny. Please remove all place, people, places, and things that are hindering us from reaching our destiny. We love you and we trust you. We thank you for your resurrection, healing powers. Amen. All right, let's get into the word. Always be joyful. Never stop praying. Be thankful in all circumstances. For this is God's will for you who belong to Christ Jesus. First Theologians chapter 5 verse 16. Always be joyful. I know that's easier than said than done for some people. But I guarantee you, if you just stop for one second and think, man, I have two legs that move and there's people out here that cannot walk. I have two eyes that can see. There are blind people. I can hear. I can feel. I'm just naming at least five things that you can be thankful for each day. So if you don't have joy for nothing else, be joyful that you are alive, that you have air in your lungs, that you have a body that you have a mind that can think. That I mean, the list could go on and on. If you're a parent, if you wake up and your children are with you. Come on now. Never stop praying. Why do you never stop praying? Because it's not going to always be all heart stars and horseshoes, clovers and blue moons. And trust me, I'm the biggest dreamer out there. I wish it could always be that way. But it won't be. Because God knew that if we had everything we wanted, some of us wouldn't even know him. But that's a whole nother subject for a whole nother day. But you want to keep praying because praying is your line of communication. You're on your phone all day anyway. You can download the Bible app like I'm using to talk to you guys today. Or you can get them on a prayer line. You can get on your phone and look at a YouTube sermon, Sarah Jakes Roberts. You can look at a Verses of the Day with T. Anything. But never stop praying. You want to have a close relationship with God. He does know your heart. He does know how your story ends and how it began and so forth and so forth. But you have the free will and life is going to happen. So Stay prayed up. Be thankful in all circumstances. Remember, what I just named, we got blind people out here, handicapped, mentally disabled people, homeless people. If you're not one of them, even if you are one of them, it can always be worse, okay? It can always be worse. It can also be better. And that's why we're growing and glowing in Christ together, because I don't know about you, but I want better, okay? So, I don't know what I want to call this one, but I'm going to think, I'm gonna, um, think of a good title, but just go out here today and be grateful. Let's, let's be joyful. Let's never stop praying, and let's be thankful. That's exactly what the word said for today. I love y'all. I hope everybody's doing well, all my Baltimore family. I hope that you know, the snow didn't um, mess you up too much, that you had food to eat and, you know, that you were comfortable, you enjoyed your snow day. Um, hopefully, we'll start growing and glowing in Christ all over the DMV. It won't just be a Baltimore. It won't just be the eight or nine of us or two or sometimes three. But the messages aren't about me, and they're all about uh just my journey with glowing and growing in Christ and whoever wanted to grow and glow with me, let's do it. All right. Have a good day on purpose. I love y'all. Thank you. See you tomorrow.